that was another great episode. Funny episode, too. Rudy's... He trusted the human God. You gotta keep trusting him. Can't let the doubt in. At least for now. He obviously ain't doing this out of kindness. It's pretty clear that this is entertainment to him. But there's definitely some arterial motives going on with the human guy. But right... (laughs) The way he felt so uh, guilty. The way his sisters view him. It's funny. Because obviously he wants respect from them. Especially now that you're meeting them. Again. After all this time. Couldn't tell her his, his name. But he trying to show off. Now he's so excited to see Roxy. It makes so much, It makes sense because of how the story began with her. And then but he fell into the trap. I'm like that's the same magic circle. That was used back then uh, when he was helping the animal people uh, kids escape and the dog was trapped on one nice callback and then that little piece of I was like I recognize this kingdom is the one that Roxy was in and then he met that little prince talking about he gonna uh, assault, uh, turn Roxy to a sex slave and then assault her in front of him and then cut his head off and like what? Yeah. And the way he's talking to his guards, obviously them they don't care for him. And he treating their families like dirt too. And yeah, hostage. He gonna need to be taught a lesson if he ain't gonna get ganked <laughs> next episode. See where this go from here. If everybody ends up coming here, cause he sent the letter. So, I'm guessing the letters to bring Roxy and her gang here to meet up with them. So, I don't know. Something big is going to happen besides him just getting rescued. But Rudish and them should be coming to look for him if he don't show back up in no time either. So, good episode nonetheless. Can't wait to see where we go from here.